This is actually the second show since I came to college that my family's going to be missing. Um, my dad passed away when I was 10, and since then it's just been me and my mom and my older brother, Adam. <laughs> I mean, I really wish they could come, but it's kind of my fault for picking a school halfway across the country, so I miss them. Hey, baby sister. Adam! Hey! What are you doing hey. here? I came to see your show. You said you couldn't come. Well, actually, Amanda, I invited him. Porter! Adam? Give me it. Yeah, so I made all the arrangements to get Amanda's brother down for the weekend. All I had to do was call his boss and convince her to give him five days off at work, book his round-trip plane ticket, uh, buy him an air mattress so he can stay at my place, and reserve him a front-row seat to every night of the musical. I just had to keep all this from Amanda and Rachel and Lisa and Dylan and Vivian and Olivia, Sarah, Jess, Rob, Marcus, Stuart. Yeah, it only took like four months of planning and half my savings account, you know? No biggie. You did this? Thank you. Oh! <laughs> What's going on over here? Guys, this is my brother, Adam. And this must be Marcus. Amanda's yeah. talked about you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This must be Jess, Amanda's dashing co-star, and uh, Marcus's boyfriend. Oh, I gave it away. Well, she mentioned you had oddly perfect teeth, and my God, I cannot say she was wrong. <laughs> so, hi, I'm Rachel Ryland, Amanda's hi. best friend and mentor. Wow, that's so weird. She's never mentioned you. Oh, totally kidding. Totally kidding. I talk about you all the time. Hey, yeah, Call him once a week does. just to talk to him. Here. So, Porter, you live right across the hall. Sure do. Huh. Wasn't well, that just a happy coincidence? Yeah. It's great to have him close by. Here, I'll get it. Rachel! Hi! Hi! Hi. What are you doing here? Well, I overheard you guys talking about hanging out at your place after rehearsal, and I just so happened to have plans to bake all these cookies, which I can't possibly eat all by myself, so I thought I'd stop by. Did I hear cookies? Oh, man! <laughs> Families love me, and Adam will be no exception. By the end of tonight, he will be thanking me for being the older, wiser sister that Amanda never had. So, you wrote this musical, book and lyrics. Sure did. <laughs> wow, it's impressive. What's it about? Well, the musical is based on the tale of the Snow Queen, but it's about mm. so much more than that. It truly uncovers the struggles of friendship and family and the powers of snow. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh, I love snow! <laughs> yeah. Don't you understand, like, a couple's really angry at each other, and all of a sudden this... I don't get it. It's out of control. Oh my god. Hey, you're still wearing that ring Dad gave you. Yeah, I never take it off. It's kind of my good luck charm. I wear it to all my auditions. I miss him. I miss him too. I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, me too. Oh. Well, it's probably mom calling to make sure I got in safe. Yeah. Hey, do you mind if I step out? No, go ahead. Tell her I said hi. Oh, tell her I said hi too, and then I miss her pies. Will do. Well, I should get going too. After all, we do open tomorrow. I will see you two in the morning. <laughs> Bye, Mr. Panda. Yeah, uh, Rachel wrote the musical. Yeah, I don't know. Um, honestly, I don't think I'm gonna like it. Um, I guess, I guess I'm just annoyed that they're having a student write the musical. Yeah, like they're charging Amanda thousands of dollars a semester to attend this place, and they can't even bother to buy the rights to a real show. Yeah, hey, I should probably get going. Um, I'll call you tomorrow. Have a good night.